a couple peeks at what if. Hey guys, before you get started, make sure you click that subscribe button. And if you don't ring that bell, you won't get any updates. Hey guys, thanks for tuning in to Comic Book Nostalgia. I'm CB Nostalgia and got a little bit of an update and a leak of Marvel's new What If series. Over the last couple weeks, we found out more and more about Marvel's Disney Plus series. And for me personally, one of the series I'm very excited about is What If. Now, recently, a series of images from What If footage screened at D23 have leaked. These images give us a pretty good idea of what's going to be going on in the show and the style of animation that they're going to use. So let's just check them out while we talk about them. We already know the first story is going to be if Agent Carter got the super serum and not Steve. But it turns out, based on these images, Steve would still be a huge part of the story. And it looks like Howard Stark will be developing some very interesting tech for the show. The second set of images features T'Challa, but not as Black Panther, as Star-Lord. We only have two, but both of them are pretty interesting. And the final images, which we're just going to put together because it seems like they may be together, features Bucky and a zombie version of Cap. If you're unfamiliar with their Marvel Zombies universe, it's really, really neat. I'm not going to spoil it, but it's a story that features most of the Marvel heroes turning into various zombies, and it's a story that I have to recommend to most readers. Now, if you're unfamiliar with What If in the comics, it's the first volume came out way back in 1977, and right now, I think we're on about volume 8 or 9. The series featured alternate versions of stories and characters set in the Marvel Universe. This series will actually be based on the movies, and all the alternate versions will be movie versions of those characters. There was a little bit of a clarification from Ashley Bradley, who's the showrunner for the series, about the episodes and what's going on. Back at D23, Kevin Feige seemed to indicate each episode of the animated series would correlate to a specific Marvel Universe film. And what she had to say was, and what Kevin really meant was they were exploring every movie in a new way, not every episode is about one movie. So don't expect 23 episodes, each one based on a movie separately. So what do you guys think of these new What If images? And do you have a What If story you would like to see him tell? Make sure you sound off in the comments below. If you like this video, make sure you press like below, click subscribe, and if you don't ring that bell, won't get any updates. Peace.